Welcome back, guys, to another episode of The Raven. What is the episode of The Raven we'll be watching tonight, Trin? <laughs> it is episode four of season one, and it's called Murphy's Law. Right, and Murphy is... Is that rat face? <laughs> I mean, yeah. I can't help it. I, it's not my face. I'm just saying. Um, yeah. So what happened in the last episode? Um, and you can maybe not mention the whole shank in the neck to Wells, but, you know, everything else. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I'll try to not mention that. But like, uh, yeah, the whole thing was they were looking for some antibiotics for Jasper and they got caught by, I, I call it the Hunger Game fog because it has the same effects, you know, it, it's acid. It, yeah, but in the so, Hunger yeah. Games, you could wash it off. On this one, they died yeah. or like got really brutally injured. So it was, I mean, w watching him go through that, that was bad. Oh yeah. Oof. Um, but I'm, I'm really intrigued. I'm still kind of interested because the concept, the characters, all good. And so far, the characters I really enjoy. Um, I'm loving Clark's mum. Yes. Um, uh, Raven is kind of. Eh, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, the concept of, of maybe Mrs. Clark, as I say, Mrs. Clark, I can't remember her name. What's her name? The mum. Abigail. Abigail. Her, the fact that she might come down to the surface is also kind of cool. Yeah, there's lots of stuff that could happen. And we've got seven seasons of this. So there's going to be lots of ups and downs, twists and turns, and it's just where it's going to be. Um, but yeah, do you want to shut up and watch it? Yes, please. All right, then. Let's get into the episode. Let's go. Well, we have a primitive wall. Made with debris and other household items. Yeah. Shouldn't be out here alone. What if I was a grounder? I got you something. It's Finn, right? Yes. Where did you get this? The art supply store. A whole pencil. Wow. <laughs> Wells was always giving me ink, charcoal, just anything I could draw with, really. Oh, she's a drawer. She's, she did the, the doodle. Yeah. The, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I found out later that he was trading his own stuff to give it to me. He let me hate him so that I wouldn't hate my mother. No. Yeah, that's a deep cut, man. Oh, he knew? My mother killed my father. Well, he did leave hints, didn't he? He was saying. Yeah. I just wish there was something I could do. Make her feel what I'm... Well, if you give her some time, she might be here. Where are you going? To make her feel it. Oh, she's going to take off her thing, isn't she? The, the wrist thing. I feel like what happened to her father was going to happen anyway, to be honest. Oh, there it is. you're there right. You no. Now she's probably not going to go down. No, this isn't right. I mean... Oh, she just won't let go, will she? Even more, yeah. It's the first terminated signal in over a week. We can still assume that things are stabilizing on Earth. Okay, how can I rationalize this to the people I need to tell that I need to go down? I need an analysis of Clark's vital signs for the past two days. Abby, just have it ready for me when I get back. She knew exactly what to do. I did it. It's still operational. Wow. Okay, so he, he can communi communicate. Yeah. My mother thinking I'm dead is only temporary. Not if I can't pass you through the dropship mainframe. I can do it. We'll be talking to the Ark by nightfall. Thank you. Bit of confidence. You think the grounders are just going to sit around and wait for us to finish the wall? That's Murphy. He does have a great face, I will say that. Maybe we should let the little girl do the lifting for you, huh? I just need some water, okay? He looks like a sleaze. <laughs> yeah. Murphy, get this guy some water. Are you fucking what the kidding fuck? me? What the hell is wrong with you, Murphy? Oh, you. Why is he doing that? You wanted a water break. <laughs> get back to work. What's wrong with this guy? Murphy's Law. Hey. What's wrong? Oh. Uh, oh, nothing. He's probably scared. Yeah. Jasper, it's been a week. Okay, you've been given a second chance, and you gotta use it. Okay, and there you go. What, what the, the hell, man? Octavia? Hey, he's gonna be too scared to go get her. Come on, bro. Octavia! There you go. Wow, he's brave. Hey, <laughs> jerk! Oh, come on. That's not funny. No, to be honest, it's probably what you needed. There's nothing to be afraid of. <laughs> he can't survive out here if he's this scared. What's that? Oh, uh. no. Fingers. Uh, okay. <laughs> What's going we on? <laughs> we still had that um, spy, didn't we, that was wearing the mask and everything. Yes, yeah. Are you headed to Mecca Station? Desmond? Yes, as a matter of fact, I am. Nice to meet you, Desmond. <laughs> You've been down there nine times in the past week. 
So? Is there something I should be made aware of? Yeah, making a shuttle. Mind if I join you? I'm still checking the bacterial levels in the station. We don't want another outbreak. Putting him off. Stop by sick day away. It's all right. <laughs> See you later. I don't want to slow you down. Just keep me informed. <laughs> Either scared of needles or don't want to be any part of that. <laughs> that one is easy, kinda. Yeah, she knows him. Can we launch without that part? We can launch, but we'll be dead before we get to the ground. And I mean, bad dead. They're good dead. <laughs> Flex wristband signal went out. I can get a pressure regulator. Today. How? The less you know, the better. What's her name? I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> But she, yeah, she's more hungry to go down. That would make sense. This knife was made of metal from the dropship. What do you mean? It means the grounders didn't kill Wells. One of us did. It was one of us. Yeah, maybe a little girl. Yeah. Thinking the grounders killed Wells is good for us. Oh, good for you, you mean. Right, I honestly thought they'd know. Don't even know whose knife that is. Oh, really? J.M. John Murphy. Oh! Right. Okay. Son of a bitch! <laughs> What's your problem? Recognize this? Oh, here it is. It's my knife. Where'd you find it? Where you dropped it after you killed Wells. Right, what? Oh, no, she slashed at his hand, so he lost fingers. Okay, his fingers. You hated Wells. Plenty of people hated Wells. You're the only one who got in a knife fight with him. Yeah, I didn't kill him then, either. Tried to kill Jasper, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's the perfect, um... You, I don't have to answer to anyone. Come again? Oh, God. Oh, like a bit of rivalry for leadership. You say there should be no rules. Does that mean that we can kill each other without punishment? I, I say we float him. How can you float him down here? That's not what I'm saying. He deserves to float. It's justice. Yeah. Revenge yeah. isn't justice. It's justice. Or is this a word for kill? Probably, yeah. Because it's meant the same thing for years. And to be fair, he didn't do it. Uh, no. What? Well, I mean, you exposed them in front of everybody. What were you thinking? Yeah, <laughs> none of this should be a surprise. <laughs> Let him go, like. I was just hanging. And he's been a, a real big douche, so there's not a lot of love. No. You can stop this. They'll listen to you. Wow. He's probably going to do it. What wow. The... Stop, okay? Murphy didn't kill Wells! Oh, are you gonna own up to it? I did! Oh, oh what the what? hell? Cl okay, I thought oh, she was gonna... I thought she was go <laughs> going she... for her. I thought she was gonna <laughs> take her head off. <laughs> Oof. This little girl and Bellamy put the thought in her head, wasn't he? Talking to her. Yeah, kill your, slay your demons or whatever. I need a pressure regulator. What for? Regulating pressure. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want for it? I owe a favor to the chief of electrical. And he's got a thing for tough, pretty girls like you. Uh, uh. No. I can't do that. And I guess you don't need to regulate pressure as badly as you thought you did. You'll float yourself, Nigel. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, float is kill in general. <laughs> Why, Charlotte? Because I was just trying to slay my demons, like you told me. There you go. What the hell is she talking about? She misunderstood me, Charlotte. That is not what I meant. Bring the girl out now! Please don't let them hurt me. Can't do that. There. This is not my fault. If she'd listened to me, those idiots would still be building the wall. Let's build a society. Bring her out. I think Clark needs to speak to Murphy because she's the one who saved him. He might actually listen. She chopped him down. So who here wants to see the real murderer hung up? Uh, it's a little girl. Uh, yeah, there's more nose. Cowards, all of you! Hey, are Murphy! Cowards. Murphy! It's over. Whatever you say, boss. I mean, I get why I'd be annoyed, but... Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh, shit! He's gonna make a play for leader. Come on, let's get the girl. Ah, gone. We snuck out. Charlotte, I know you can hear me! And when I find you, you are gonna pay me! There's definitely a portion of this group that's very unstable. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, it's... <laughs> It's a little girl. I don't understand. I mean, I, I really hate that Wells got killed. I do. <laughs> but that, that, that doesn't really make me feel better about any of this. No. Are you sure Nigel has a part? If she can get one, yeah. Okay, I'll take care of it. What are you going to do? 
The less you know, the better. Is she gonna do it? Uh, probably Mama Bear. She's probably coming in there hard. Hello, Dr. Griffin. Nigel. Oh. Morphine. What do you want for it? Pressure regulator. I underestimated Raven. Here we go. Morphine would be very valuable. Yeah, I can get you a pressure thingy. Okay. And he's watching. He's going to connect the dots. What the hell do you think you're doing? Just because we saved you doesn't mean you're forgiven. Got it? Yeah, we still hate you, but we just don't want to see a little girl like hung up. <laughs> it's really it's really quite simple. She's just a kid. She's a killer. You killed someone, Charlotte. Ended his life. You can't just kill someone to make yourself feel better. I think she gets it. Yeah. I mean, well, you pretended to kill yourself to feel better because your mom will feel not good. We should run. Yeah, that's where yeah. we go. I also worry when you traumatize a kid so much and like hammer it home that they start doing stuff to themselves. Yeah. Get in. This is a great idea as well. Like, because this was Earth, you're probably going to find all kinds of things. We had a car. Look, this is like a little bunker. Oh, this would have been a survival shelter, wouldn't it? Like, yeah. fallout shelter. All the food expired like 90 years ago. Yeah, but we could repurpose. Share with the group. You can share this with the group. What's that? The pens. Oh. Oh, that's why I had one. <laughs> yeah. Looks like they never made it here. No. I figure the bombs took them by surprise. Bombs. They couldn't have lived more than a few years down here. And then when they ran out of food, they would have opened the doors and been dead within a few days. Would they? Because there's grounders, right? Yeah. Maybe they are alive. We think the grounders are a threat. Now we're killing each other. There have to be consequences. We can't just let them hang people. You're going to need a, a system, a jury. <laughs> Hopefully we figure it out before Murphy kills us for helping her. Crazy, isn't it? You can reset time and certain things end up exactly how they're going to always be. Yep. You're going to need a judge, jury, executioner thing is all going to come about. How fast can you install it? I don't know, a few hours maybe? We may not have that much time. I'm on it. Go on, Raven, I believe in you. Our ancestors built this ark to be our salvation. Our test. Are you here to join us? He's here to see me, Vera. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> nope. Oh, okay, yeah, he's here for her. Your mother's inspired today, Marcus. That's his mum? Okay, wow. Why did you bring me down here, Nigel? I have something for you. Oh, she called for him. Unless it's a signed confession, I'm not interested. Not even if it involves your friend, Abby Griffin? Okay. Pressure. Wow. She and a girl named Raven Reyes asked me to get them a pressure regulator. You're a plague on this ship, Nigel. And even if what you said is true, it's your word against a member of the council. I think she's more focused on Raven, to be fair. You should thank me. Morphine. With Abby out the way, your agenda should sail right through. I don't know what you're talking about. Is he having, like, emotions? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh. And that's uh -oh. why you don't scream at the kid. Then wake up. She's going to run. She's scared. She doesn't want to, like, you know, like, every, everything they were talking about, she heard all of it. She don't want to be on, on trial. She's gone. Like, if Bellamy had not said what he said, oh, she wouldn't have done it. That's Bellamy, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm glad it's her that found her, not someone else. Whew. Can't hide wow, witch hunt. <laughs> For a very, very young girl. Yeah. I'm not your sister. Just stop helping me. <laughs> no, come on, man. Murphy has her. Hey. Wow. Abby, how about I pace in the operating room next time you're working? <laughs> <laughs> Abby, did you take morphine from the clinic? Oh, no, got out. They inventoried already. Kane was just here. He's on his way to Mecca to arrest both of you right now. How much longer? 20 minutes. Oh, They're come on. Five. Uh, go really quick. Only one of us needs to get to the ground, Raven. The second you find those kids, you radio back. They'll float you. Not if you're quick. <laughs> Not if you're really, really quick. Hug later. <laughs> yeah. But if she can give proof that all the kids are alive, or well, most of them, just don't mention Wells. Follow me! 
You cannot fight all of us. Give her up. Wow. Here we are. Just calm down. We'll talk about this. I'm sick of listening to you. Wow. Oh, come on. Okay, I'll make you a deal. You come with me right now. I will let her go. Don't do it, Charlotte. No. no. Oh, I can see someone slipping. I can see her jumping. I can't let any of you get hurt anymore. Not because of me. Charlotte! No! There you go. Yep. You're yeah. Right. Uh, you're all happy now? Quite a good little actress. I could see in her eyes she kind of just yeah. switched off. Alright, Murphy. Oh, you're done. <laughs> <laughs> it was so vindictive, man. To go after a little girl. If we're going to survive down here, we can't just live by whatever the hell we want. We need rules. And who makes those rules? Huh? Council. You. For now, we make the rules. Okay. So what then? We just take him back and pretend like it never happened? No! Prisoner, trial. It's all going to be the same thing. We're going to have a council. We banish him. Really? Um. But wait, he didn't do anything. She jumped. If I ever catch him in your camp, we'll be back here. Understand? I mean, he went over the overboard, but he nearly got hung because of her and he was coming after her, but he didn't do anything to her. As for the four of you, you can come back and follow me or go off with him to die. I don't like Murphy, but I kind of feel like, this is more fair? Banish him? You might as well kill him. Yeah. He, he's a douche. We all can agree he's a douche. Oh. He's like, you're gonna need it, mate. As far as we know right now, banishing him is killing him. Probably worse. Come on, Raven. Come on. I believe in you. I don't know why I believe in you, but I believe in you. It was a bad part. On purpose. Wow. Yeah, okay. Well, I guess if you have a space suit, you don't need pressure, right? Yeah. Your infected mechanic, Raven Reyes. What's she up to? I just make something up. Right. There's a story behind this. We all love you. <laughs> Let me break it down. You got 20 minutes? Did you know that her boyfriend, Finn Collins, was one of a hundred. Oh, Finn is her boyfriend. Okay. Your obsession. Oh. Is now going to get her floated too. Mm, no, she's probably going to get her heart broken. Because Finn is Finn to get Clark. Yep. You still don't understand. I'm trying to save all of us. But mostly you want to see if your daughter's okay. Arrest her. Continue the search for Raven Reyes. Sir. Yeah, I hope you're wearing spacesuits. <laughs> yeah. There. Yeah, gone. Yeah, there ain't no <laughs> way she's still in that room by the time they get there. What have you done? No, you, she was right here. She did nothing. You have to know the truth. Does she? Can she lie at all? No, she's uh, too pure. I was like, what do you mean? What do I do? I'm here. I don't know what the hell's going on. Will we be able to talk to them? No, more like Morse code. You want to do the honors? Are we gonna get teased for the next episode? Looks like it. No? Ah, shit! Ooh. All of them go down? Wait, this is actually worse. So that's not good, right? Sit there at your own risk. I think I might be cursed. Or you're not cursed. Unlucky then. Brave. Murphy's Law. <laughs> She's gonna kiss him. She's gonna kiss him. Do it. Confidence. I didn't see anyone else step up. And bravery is always rewarded. With a kiss. There it is. <laughs> you can feel it coming. Yeah. Just don't tell my brother. Hey. <laughs> I was worried that he saw her. I'm like, oh no, he's going to say something. <laughs> I like that. Ben, stop it. Calm down. We're dead to them. They're going to die up there. And we're alone. We're not alone. You are not alone. Are they going to kiss as well? Oh, and if Raven walks in on them, he's saying, I'm, I'm going to call bullshit on that. <laughs> 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 hey, I just landed and I found this hatch. What? <laughs> going back up right now. <laughs> oh, okay. They're going full in. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And there's poor Raven. Yeah. She's having a hell time. <laughs> yeah. Really, really struggling to get back to him. 
Right. It's setting things up to be very spicy going forward. Yeah. I'm going to get all the relationship stuffs. But we're not seeing um, uh, grounders much, are we? No. They've kind of disappeared for a little bit. Like they were a thing and then now they've stopped. So that's still going to be a thing. There's going to be grounders. I don't know. You go, you go, you go. Yeah, I mean, the um, the Murphy stuff, what happened to Murphy, is, it sucks a little bit. <laughs> He's a douche. Like, he was straight up peeing on the guy who was working. I didn't like that, him at all, you know. That, that, that was actually really, really bad. But he actually didn't do anything to Wells. He, he, like, he, he, yeah, he probably, he probably would have done something to Wells. He probably would have done something to Charlotte. But he didn't. So... What what do you do with that? Because, I mean, they just said, well, we can't just decide who lives or dies. I, 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 we don't know how the show's going to turn out. He might not be dead. But as far as I'm concerned, in a, in a strange world where someone just got speared from an unknown grounder, exactly. that you've just killed him. But not, not quickly. But slowly, maybe. You might just starve to death or he might get caught and like, his skin peeled or something. You don't know what the hell you've just left him to. So I, I find that a bit a bit weird. <laughs> That's better. Yeah. Like, Oh, we'll just banish him. Okay. Sure. <laughs> right. But like the good, th- let's say the good thing that came out of it is now you have Clark and Bellamy having some truce, you know, having, it's going to calm down with let's do whatever we want and let's, yeah, that, that that needs to stop because if they don't kill each other, something else will kill them and they need to st- try and be more careful and have some rules still, you know. Yeah, building the wall was a really good idea. I don't know how useful it's going to be because we don't know what they're up against. These grounders, that one we saw, I don't know, man. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what they're capable of. And I thought they were cutting people's fingers off in, in the jungle, but I forgot the fact that when she stabbed him in the neck, he put his hand up and she went like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With a knife and, and he pro- she probably lopped off a couple of fingers. Um, but yeah, I didn't even think of that. But yeah, Charlotte, she was just she just listened to bad advice. Kids are very impressionable. And I think, you know, whatever they do... They're only a reflection of what you tell them. Like she's she's not really formed any of her own opinions yet. She's still very young. Yeah. So saying, oh, like, you need to slay your demons, and she's seeing him telling her that, and he's a jackass, and he has this bravado about him, and she's, like, thinking, oh, well, I know what I need to do then. I'll just, just kill Wells. I'll do that, you know? And, like, it was completely not something she really gave much thought. She just had an opportunity, and she took it. Yeah. Um, and no, I don't think like holding her holding your hand is a good sign. It's like you know you you need to know you've done something wrong. Fundamentally, you did a bad thing, but we're not about to let you get killed or hung up or whatever. And so it was just yeah, I don't know. I I feel like um, <laughs> whether they like it or not, what they just left is probably what they're going to form right now. They're going to have their own council and like oh, do we have to call it a council? No, we can call it a I don't know a jacuzzi. Like if you want, <laughs> yeah. it's still going to be the same bloody thing. They're still going to have to have a decision, the majority rules. And they could have done that right now with Murphy. What do we do? What is, what is the tier of punishment for a guy who was threatening someone but did actually, actually did nothing? Like, can we agree on that? But no, just, are oh, you banished? We'll start tomorrow. Right, guys? <laughs> uh, it, seemed, it just seems odd to me. There might be people who see it differently. I mean, I, I, I wouldn't blame them, but that's how I see it. I don't know about you. Yeah, same. I mean, I see it. Uh, for me, like, maybe... Put him in some sort of jail. I don't know. It'd until be a start, there, right? Yeah. Yeah. There's a little trial to see what he's done, actually. And a proper trial, no? A proper what he... And even if he's, like, having people say, oh, he's really bad to me, or I don't know. I don't know. Try to have some some rules, something. But banish him just like that for me was too much. Because I feel like if he comes back, he's one of them characters... Who would probably have so much hate and resentment? He will never like be your ally anymore. No, at all. And if he meets the grounders, then you've got the whole thing. What did he tell them? Like, they know our, they know our defenses. They know we have no yeah. weapons. Like ah, you open, it's a whole can of worms, man. You keep you open on yourself. I don't know, but I'm I'm interested. I'm really really getting into it. Um, I was already into it, but it's it's really spicing up. Um, not just with like everything we just saw, but also the potential of Raven. Ah, oh, sorry. Uh, she's coming down <laughs> to the planet, <laughs> and she has a boyfriend called Finn, who's uh, I don't know, teen coitus- coitusing on the couch. <laughs> like, let's just say that. Yeah, that's gonna be spicy. Yeah, because Raven doesn't look like uh, a slouch. No. She looks like she could probably hand herself. So Clark really wants to, I don't know, uh, bone up on her self defense. 
Um, but no, I've got nothing really else to say on this one. What about you? Yeah, I'm the same. All right then. Okay, we'll end it here. We'll catch you all in the next episode of The Hundred. Wow. They look they're at a spa or something. <laughs> it's almost done. We should probably get going. Or we could just lie around in bed all day. Your girlfriend's coming, bro. Last night wasn't just about needing someone. I needed you. You understand that, right? Oh. Well, no, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Last night for me wasn't really about you. Is he trolling? Just my first earth sex. <laughs> <laughs> what an asshole. Oh, it's getting worse on the arc. Yeah. The council is granted to you work release pending review. The prison section has been on half air since midnight. Oh. Really? I'm not going to take more than my share. The council approved Kane's population reduction plan. You voted without me. We followed the rules of order. You're in prison. The approval is unanimous. We need to wait for Raven to report back. How long do we wait, though? Take this. People are suffering. You can help. The two plans have to go side by side. Raven will make it to Earth. I know she will. Okay, then she makes it. speak to her. Yeah, then, then you can stop doing this, but... You have to, right? You have to keep them in, in sync. Once they realise yeah. they don't need to do it, they can stop. But if they have to realise hours later Raven doesn't report back, then then they have to start. And it's time gets shorter, you know? Arceus valve. <sighs> Open. Didn't touch the ground yet. Yeah, it's still going. Okay. <sighs> Kiss your ass goodbye. Retro <laughs> fire. Well, okay, she'll be on the ground in about three and a half minutes. <laughs> I hope. I hope. Everything's falling apart, man. Oh, no, come on, man. It's very crucial to the mission she, that she stays alive. Yeah. That's the only reason I'm saying that. If we brought the stuff back, then they'd know that we found some place. And where would we go next time someone pulls a Murphy and goes ballistic? <laughs> pulls a Murphy. It's going to be a thing. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, we knew anyway. And that's when we see Raven coming down. <laughs> oh man, if she walks in on them having a kiss on the entire planet, you're like, oh no, that's just really, really, really bad. Good. Yep. Oh, okay, because she she's gonna see it. There you go. Okay, so she can't surprise them. Shooting star. No. You should make a wish. A shooting Raven. Then that's not a shooting star. Wow, he's doing okay, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Seriously. There. They're coming to help us. Please tell me they brought down some shampoo. What? That's all the problems you have. <laughs> it's probably nutrition packs, medical supplies. There'd be a radio. Nobody thought any of us would survive, but we did. We should take a minute to appreciate that. Yeah, after we go and have a look at the pod. Okay, minute's done. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we should get moving, everyone's ready. No one's going anywhere. Not while it's dark, it isn't safe. We'll head out at first light, pass the word. Okay, well, Clark will see you there in the morning. Everyone for a hundred miles saw this thing come down. What if the grounders get to it first? I said we wait until sunrise. Octavia spitting the truth right now. Yeah, for someone who never dealt with people, she's really doing well. <laughs> yeah. Green circle, a little smooshed. It's an oval. Thanks, Dad, I forget. Whose eyes are they testing? <laughs> now the other eye. Nothing, it's just black. Oh. Let me know if you see anything at all. Are you doing it? Ah. Uh, We're finished. Why don't you wait outside while I talk to your dad? Completely blind in one eye. Let me get this out of your eyes. I don't know how you can see. I can't see. That's why we're here. <laughs> oh. 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 Don't worry, the rolling of the eyes and the attitude doesn't last long. 10, 15 years, maybe. Yeah, 15. <laughs> We're gonna fix it, right? Like always? I hope so. I'm just waiting for Raven to say everything's okay. Why aren't you monitoring the radio? Listening for Raven. Well, have you looked outside? We're slammed. Making contact with the ground is the only way we can really help these people. Yeah, instead of killing people, we could just ship them down if we can still. Yeah. Station medical. If you're receiving, please 
Oh no. This is not good. I guess they're gonna need to find her like as soon as possible. Where the hell is Bellamy? He took off a while ago. I told everyone to stay. Whatever's in that thing, he wants it. We've gotta get there before he does. Yeah, because he doesn't want any interaction. Because he's yeah. Yeah. He spent every single minute since we landed making sure no one on the ark finds out we're alive. I screwed up. Let myself get distracted. Oh, is that what that was? Oh come on. Yeah, Sometimes she frustrates me. Yeah. She's good with the words. You always want to play the big brother, huh? Well, guess what? Joke's on me. You're just a selfish dick. I did this for you. To protect you. She's been saying don't do this. What did you do? Someone came to me with a deal. Kill him and they get me on the drop ship. You killed the Chancellor? And you're going to throw all those lives away for yourself. I didn't ask you to do that. This is on me. Whatever they sent down, I'll take care of it. Uh, he really doesn't let it go. I didn't ask yeah. for any of this. A lot, of, a lot of children are gonna die now, bro, if you don't let them know that everything's okay down here. It will appear to be a malfunction of the fire containment system. It will look like an accident. All residents of Section 17 will be in their sleep period. Wow, big, big accident. It should be painless. Document needs your approval. Uh. What a difficult choice, man. Well, decision. You have it, with one alteration. You'll give the order to cut off the oxygen. Yeah, go on, enjoy. I don't have the authority. You do now. Your capacity as chancellor. Tonight, I will be at section 17. And when those doors are closed on those people, their fate oh. will be my fate. Wow, man. Don't do this. My mind is made up. And he's telling him not to. You have a strength that is not weakened by sentiment. And that's exactly what it's going to take for us to survive. Yeah, I mean, we said it, didn't we, early on that yeah. He's not enjoying any of this, but I thought he wanted to be Chancellor, but he's telling him not to do it. Uh-oh. Oh, no. He got to her. I want to see if she's awake. My money's on her, man. I hope he knows her or something or whatever. I don't think it'll matter. Oh, okay. Oh, he just okay. sabotaged the radio. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Now they can't talk back. What an asshole! All those people! Come on, man! You go that way. Okay. The bottom. Okay. Finn's gonna know who it is. <laughs> I mean, we might be wrong about that, but I'm assuming Finn is supposed to be her boyfriend, right? Because it was the... Yeah, I mean, she symbol. said it, I think. No, wasn't it the, the metal bird thing or something? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. That's not good. Still look great, girl. Hi. <laughs> And Finn's conveniently not here. Of course. <laughs> oh, look, look, look. Um, 180? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Finn! Oh, my God. <laughs> and kiss. Make it really awkward. You're bleeding. I'm okay. Wow. One-sided relationship here. After all, she was just a distraction, right? Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. How did you get here? How you do you think? Scrap hold on deck. You built that from scrap? Oh, okay. I kind of rebuilt it. I do more for you and worse. Just like you would for me. Oh, she's down bad, man. We really need to, like, a concussion check or something. I don't know. Yeah. We've known each other our whole life. We don't need to talk about it. She needs to put pressure on the wound. But when you say, how did you get down here? You, you saw the pod, right? But he, yeah, specifically. <laughs> <laughs> this is Clark. She was on the dropship, too. Clark? Your mum. Well, this is all because of your mom. My mom? This was all her plan. We have to tell them you're alive. No radio. Can blame Balami. The radio's gone. Someone got here before us. This belongs to the... Was it? Wells? I didn't... I couldn't read it. So you're gonna die peacefully and leave humanity in the hands of Kane, Chancellor Kane? I am doing what is right. I mean, I, I like... I like her, um... Hunger for saving people. Yeah. How would you tell your son that you let these people die without doing absolutely everything in your power to save them? It was Wells' chess set. Yeah. Yeah, that's what that, right. That's what that said. But I feel like if she was Chancellor, we'd be doing a lot and achieving very little. Do you get that vibe? I, I don't hate her for, for caring. I mean, it's, it, it's cool. You need that conflict. You need the other opinion. Yeah, but yeah, like 
like how long she can she would be waiting like this is already so critical my name is jake griffin today i need to talk to you about our future because i don't want 300 people to die i know that much i want raven to be able to message uh oh yeah, I mean, and let's not forget, there's people on the ground. <laughs> yeah. Why is Octavia out here by herself? I mean, I know her brother pushed her away, but... How far were we? Oh, come on, girl, you're better than that. Uh-oh. Oh, no. She just went full raven. Yeah. That's a thing. She pulled a raven. <laughs> They're getting ready to kill 300 people up there. It'll be working people, your people. Bellamy, where's the radio? Oh, I want this. I want this standoff. Bellamy Blake? They're looking everywhere for you. Shut up. He shot Chancellor Jaha. Oh. That's why you took the wristband. And all that, whatever the hell we want, you just care about saving your own skin. New Murphy. Yeah. Jaha deserved to die. You all know that. Yeah, he's not my favorite person either, but he isn't dead. Yeah, he's still alive, man. Don't you see what this means? You're not a murderer. He's just an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Where's the radio? It's too late. It's in the, it's in the river. Oh, man. Today I need to talk to you about our future. Oh, she's gone public with the video. Oh. The Ark is dying. It's playing everywhere. Tech's trying to shut it down. We should never have let her out of the cell. Yeah. <laughs> Instantly knows who it is. Yeah. In 12 hours, 320 people will be sacrificed to extend our oxygen supply. I hope she's buried in the ship. Dr. Abigail, no. Open this door the future doesn't belong to the Chancellor or the Council. It belongs to all of us. And now there's a full panic and everyone's going to be taking up more oxygen because they're going to be worried and stressed and shouting. I really don't know what's the plan there. I, I, yeah, I don't know. She's stalling for time. I get it. We don't have to talk to the Ark. We just have to let them know we're down here, right? Yeah, but how do we do that with no radio? She's she's really, really good. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All we need is a bag of rice. I made a volunteer, I guess you call it. What? Volunteer. For what? To die. Section 17, sir. Oh, people are going to volunteer for Section 17. This morning you told me my daughter was going blind. There was nothing I could do to help her. No, he can't. Turns out there is. Count me in. What the hell, man? I didn't expect this. No. I'll take a spot in 17. What? Let's give my wife a little extra hair. Oh. That's really sweet. I didn't expect this reaction at all. Jake was right. It would bring out the best in us. Yeah, they didn't trust the people to be able to make their own choice. Yeah, I, was, I, didn't, I didn't think it'd go here. I thought there would be people like panicking, as you said, and stuff, but no. Yeah, but I guess, I guess there's, everyone's got someone in their lives they want to save. Pull out those firing circuits in one piece or they won't work. But F Raven can still make it okay. If we get the rockets to launch, will they see them from the Ark? It's all about burn time and cloud cover. That's the first emotional response this show's given me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what the hell? Yeah. But I know your mom will be watching. I've never seen anyone love someone the way she loves you. You know that, right? Did. It's complicated. Yeah, Clark's in a really difficult position. <laughs> she didn't even know <laughs> she was being with someone who was with someone else. Abby's announcement proved to be very convincing. They spoke to something that was already inside of them. The new chancellor. I should remember that. He's still gonna do it? You don't need to do this now. Who can inspire people to self-sacrifice? You're that man, not me. Kane's talking the truth, man. He doesn't want to be chancellor. <laughs> And I really don't hate him, to be honest. No, I that mean, he, he's much. really tr trying to save as many people as possible. Why do you have to work the double shift? Things need to get done. This poor guy. You'll be good for Miss Lucy. Thanks, because I was going to totally be terrible if you didn't remind me. <laughs> <laughs> Just give me a kiss. Aww. She doesn't even know it's the last time she's going to see Daddy. Hey. I love you. I love you too. Oh, she has no idea. I really hope Raven can pull out uh, a call. Yeah. If she does it just after they kill all these people, ugh. I like two men. Monitoring the radio. Nice. Even got the monitor. I gave clear orders. Thank you. I've 
He's making me cry, man. What the I hell? know. Everything's killing me. <laughs> this is for my daughter. She's thinking about doing right for the people that are left behind. Yeah, we need to speed run the hell out of this. That fan's gonna go off, isn't it? A very symbolic uh, thing. Yeah. Abby is going to be devastated if they get the signal after this goes away. Yeah. Well, I love that people are pulling together. Yeah. Let's go I'm... get those rockets up. Everyone pulling together in the arc and on Earth. <laughs> yeah. Sir, all vents and hatchways to Section 17 are closed. The order. Hey, Gator's back. Oh, he's back. It's difficult to watch. Yeah, this is just gonna suck. I'm just, I'm, I'm being so hopeful. <laughs> I'm being so hopeful. Because it's gonna take a while for the oxygen to be completely drained. Because they're not gonna vacuum it, I don't think. They're just gonna cut it off. I mean, if we see the fan go the other way, then they're, they're taking it out. Come on. Oh, nice. Okay. I thought they needed to be a bit <laughs> higher than that. Oh, come on. It wouldn't be instant, would it? I mean, you'd go into some kind of sleep first. We still have time, maybe. They're all dead. Oh, man. This is difficult. Yeah, this is nuts. Is no one seeing anything? And that hair clip. Oh, my God. Oh, can't deal with this. <laughs> <laughs> Can you wish on this kind of shooting star? I don't even know what to wish for. What about you? Yeah, I saw them together like this, like fireworks night. Yeah. And I, d I think Raven will, I think any girl would read a vibe or some situation going on if this keeps up. And she, oh gosh, she's out there alone still. I forgot. Yeah, I forgot about her as well. Oh my ah! god, man. Come on. That's a big dude. Yeah. We make the best choices that we can. And then we put our faith in a forgiving God. I think we deserve to be forgiven. What else are you supposed to do? Then they volunteered. Oh, yeah. look. Look, look. See that light? Oh. Did you see that? Look. <laughs> there it is, look. Shit. Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> it just waited a little bit longer, but that's the thing. You don't know that. No. You let time, you know, too much time go past, you're losing air every second. And that's why that's why I'm actually enjoying this show. Um, but you go first. Go. Yeah, it was, uh, I'm going to say a beautiful episode, but no, like it tricked me. And I hate seeing people sacrifice and dying, like mass death, you know, like that. It's really sad. Um <clears throat> And now that we know that they could have, like, they could have been saved. I don't know. It's, it's, this episode showed how hard the choices that need to be made in such situation. It was really, um, yeah, it was, it was a shocking episode. Um, it's re reflective of real life. I mean, when, yeah. when, when a leader has to make choices about some lives versus mass, you know, lots and lots of lives versus a few lives. I say a few, but in the scheme of things, 300 compared to everyone else on the arc. Uh, we saw a similar thing with Black Sails when they were doing the rationing and the water and everything. Yeah. And you're like, yeah, it, you need, you still need a crew. You still need uh, people to generate life. If they manage to get down to the planet, you fundamentally still need people to do that. Yeah, so functioning if you, people. Yeah. yeah, so if you just ration everybody and you take the air away from everybody, there's a good chance, you know, you're going to lose the wrong people in the sense of, like, engineers, uh, I don't know, atmospheric, like, people that can, like, build a new civilization on Earth, as it is right now. This way you get to pick, you know, the people that will bring the most. And it's sad. It's really sad. And I was hoping they'd get the message before all of it happened. But it was so touching when they just stepped up and went, nah, screw it. There you go. Bang. I want to save my wife. Yeah. I want to save my daughter. I want to save whoever. Like, and they just did it. And it's like, you really didn't have enough faith in people. But it could go one or two ways. I thought there'd be a riot. I thought it'd be sucking up oxygen. And then all of a sudden, now anything you try to do discreetly, you can't do it. See a lot, yeah. and that's what he was saying. That's what Kane was saying. She's left us with two choices, which is <laughs> not preferable. Yeah, this is the first episode of this show that really got me thinking, really made me care a lot, and is now making me really excited to 
kick on, you know? Same. And then you've got the little side thing, you know, with Raven and Clark and, yeah. and Finn. And now uh, Octavia, that was wow. a big, that was a big dude. And, and not, a, not a teenager, not a kid. It was, it was a strapping man. So I think things are about to get real, uh, like proper real. Because the Grounders, we've heard about them. We know they're there. And we saw like one of them with a mask on. But yeah, now we're seeing them come into it maybe. Because uh, what episode was this? Five. Five. And how many is there? Uh, on this, uh, 13. 13 on this season. Okay. Yeah. Right, okay, so we've got some episodes to go. So yeah. Um, but no, I'm, I'm really liking it. I like that we're, that we're getting slowly introduced and yeah i don't know enjoyed this one a lot even though it was very harrowing and and yeah but i got really yeah. involved and emotionally into it so it was that was a good sign uh but i've got nothing else to really say on this one what about you yeah i'm all done with this one as well okay uh yeah, we'll catch you all in the next episode of the hundred bye cheers bye guys <laughs>